my neighbor called from up north and said, hey, can you go check on my husband or, you know, my, my husband and uh, his friend? They hadn't talked to him all day. So I just walked in the house and I was screaming for him. Two men were found dead inside of a home with a gas leak on Fort Myers Beach. And the culprit seems to be something you may have at your home. And tonight we're hearing that 911 call from a neighbor for the first time. ABC 7's Kennedy Mason has been on top of this story since Sunday morning. Kennedy, what have you learned? We know a disconnected pool pump that connected to the second floor caused a gas leak, which is what led to two men dead inside. Mike Dewitt and Jake Fowler were found dead at this house Saturday night. My neighbors. Something, yeah. something coming out of my neighbor's house and I walked in and I tried to get them to come out and uh, I came back out. I, I can't go back in there. He, he's not moving. Okay, is, is he not breathing? Not nothing. He's doing nothing. Stephen Sexton, who lives next door, found the two men after Dewitt's wife hadn't heard from him all day and asked Sexton to check on him. He smelled a strong natural gas smell coming from the house. And I ran out of the house because I don't know if the house smells so bad, I don't think I could be in there. Sexton told us Fowler came here from Indiana to help do it with his construction projects. He said that do it and Fowler weren't just neighbors to him. They were family. We tried talking with several other people who knew the men, but none are ready to speak on camera. Local on Fort Myers Beach, Kennedy Mason, ABC 7. Kennedy, thank you. This wasn't the only gas leak that happened in Lee County this weekend. There was an ammonia leak on Metro Parkway near Daniels at the Ready Ice. Crews with South Trail Fire and Rescue were sent to check out a strange odor in the area Saturday night. Firefighters say they found a leaking ammonia tank outside the building. Nobody was hurt. They're still working to figure out how much ammonia leaked. It's our promise here on ABC 7 to get you more. So we're digging deeper into what you should do if you think you smell gas or some type of chemical in or near your home. If you're inside, you want to call 911 right away. Get outside and get away from your home. Experts recommend getting at least 300 feet away from where it seems to be coming from. Close doors and windows behind you so the gas doesn't escape. Don't use anything electrical like light switches, appliances, or a garage door opener to get outside because that can spark a fire. You want to avoid lighting candles, cigarettes, or vapes if you smell something suspicious. And do not attempt to turn off your gas meter. You want to leave that to professionals.